Yo! What is up, everybody? What's going on? It is your boy, Paragu, back again. And today, I just want to try something a little bit different. Guys, you know, I understand that there is many, many different ways to play this game. You know, I'm very fond of the opportunist play style. And uh, I understand that that might rub some people the wrong way, you know, just to like, you know, hide in the bushes, pop out with an item, you know, just like third party people, you know, some people might say that, you know, might make the game unfair or not fun. But, uh, you know, that's just what I like doing. But today, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to try something a little bit different. Today, it's on site with any jabron that crosses my path. No running, no hiding. We're going to run up, done up. This is how to instantly adjust your play style in Rumble versus Ladies and Gentlemen. All right, let's go. Hot start, fuego start. Just landing in the lava dome, off the ripper. Looking like a ghost town, ghost town dome. Nobody wants to smoke. All right, big sumo off the ripper. We're looking pretty good. Oh, my goodness. Big time elbow drop out of nowhere. But, you know, sometimes you got to get up with the spinning back fist, even though it might not always be the best idea. Because uh, sometimes it does confirm, you know, especially when your opponent is just a complete uh, Neanderthal, you know, from the uh, Prezozoic era. You know, they're just a, a Cro-Magnon long skull dope, and they just keep running toward you without trying to read you. And uh, just look at this... Uh, Brown right here just gets hit with big time drop kick. You know what guys, I'm not going to run. I'm not going to hide, you know. Oh, super sumo just knocking this person to the outside of the ring. Let's go. All right. And a big time crate to the uh, dome of the competitor. They seem to be very fond of the drop kick, ladies and gentlemen. And you know what? Might be their downfall. Seems like they're a dropkick spammer. So, uh, got them downloaded and got them defeated. All right, let's go, ladies and gentlemen. All right, they're never really down, are they? They are never really down in this bitch. And this person just keeps going for the edge, which uh, makes me pretty happy. Gives me full confidence. I should be able to completely take out this uh, Jabron just using this complete disappointment of a move. All right, let's go, ladies and gentlemen. They're just spamming dropkick. Not getting any part of it right now. And I'm getting these licks off. I'm getting this damage off. I'm getting these wombos off. Just knocking them to the outside of the ring again. Feeling hella unkillable right now. Just chugging chicken. All right. Volley dive. Here come the big time womps. All right. This person just uh, loves me a drop kick. So I'm probably just going to shield. And, uh, ooh, well timed dodge roll by them. And another edge move. Making me feel completely safe. Like, I should be able to get the dub right now. All right. Seems like a big-time clash. Oh, my goodness. Another drop kick. They're back on their feet. Let's hope their shoes provide good art support. City. Kui might All right, guys. A new champion here. I cannot believe that just happened. Come back at 21 competitors the left. If I did not KO that person in the next move, ladies and gentlemen, I would have hung up the gloves. I would I would have called it a day. I would I would have deleted everything, took it all down. I would have ended it right there. Come back in the big beginning, ladies and gentlemen. That that's just unacceptable. All right, but you see, chugging the reds, build right now. Not not really uh not really too concerned about it, cause uh you know it doesn't matter when you just run up done up. When when you uh use these high level tactics, when you use these big time wombo combos, it doesn't matter. Oh, Jay burned in my sights. All right, let's see you guys. Let's see these uh new big time combos. All right, didn't didn't quite get the first one. Didn't quite get a confirm on that. But that is okay, ladies and gentlemen, because you know what? Today, we are not going to be some sick opportunist. Today, we are going to combo our opponents to death. All right, wall splat, Irish whip, big time sumo slap. You already know, getting off these gigantic wombos. All right, just had to sumo slap the air there for good measure. Just uh, had to take up some real estate, just making sure there's nowhere for him to run, nowhere for him to hide. Big time DDT slamming him on his neck. You know? This guy, he uh, might be a little uh, artificially intelligent, but, uh, you know, he could just suck at the game. So, uh, everybody try to add Venus Fly Plant on Epic, and uh, if he adds you back, 
then I have actual skill and just defeated a real player with wombo combos. And if not, then uh, there's still 13 people left, ladies and gentlemen. Lava Dome, looking like a ghost town right now. These people probably just uh, evacuated the premise as they can sense the aura of a uh, high level uh, rumbler. Or a potential high level rumbler, sorry. Um, they need to drop a ranking system so uh, everybody can know how good I am at the game. Alright. So don't want any part of what's in that box. Just gonna just walk away from all that debris on the ground. Oh. Now. This is what I'm talking about, ladies and gentlemen. This is the build that I might be going for from now on. The 4-4-2. Alright, look at this complete jabron. About to get Arnold Palmered out the ring. Oh my goodness. Look at this man with the little sumo slaps. This man made a big ass mistake when he thought he could sumo slap better than me. You cannot match my sumo slap style. Of course, just popping superstar. You already know because I don't need comeback. I'm not running. I'm not hiding. So, what's the point of comeback if I'm running up, running up, managed to get superstar, superstar, superstar out of nowhere. But, of course, this man is never truly down, ladies and gentlemen. And I'm a little conflicted right now as I could run from this person to chase that person. But then that would allow the opportunity for me to uh, later then be an opportunist and defeat that person. So, you know what? I'm going to let him be a reverse opportunist and catch me. So, I'm just going to keep fighting this guy. All right, big time dive kick. Let's see what this turns into. To a stamina break, into a Irish whip. Oh my goodness, big time wombos off the wall. Oh my goodness, big time dive kick again. Downed. That is another wombo combo elimination. But of course, they are never truly down, ladies and gentlemen. Not until the fat lady sings. I don't even know if that who says that shit anymore, ladies and gentlemen. You see what's going on. Not only are we adjusting play styles on the fly, many things are changing. But I'm dead. Oh my goodness. Is that a. Is that like a thing? Is that like supposed to be like that? I feel like that's like exploitable. Like, I don't know. I feel like if you could get that off. That's, uh, I don't know, I, I don't know, maybe not, you know, maybe it might be hard to get off, but I feel like if you could just kind of do that move, you know, kind of anytime you want, kind of broken. New meta, guys, don't pick up Cyclone books, there's no point, just, just use the dead emote and get up with spinning back fist. Alright, Ghost Town Kiki right now. Everybody just doesn't want to smoke. I've literally eliminated every person I came across. And then they use comeback. Except for that one guy who ran away. I don't know what's the optimal strat here. If it's just to stay and fight and then get eliminated. Or if it's to live and fight another day. Oh! Smoke has been located. Ladies and gentlemen. So, uh, adapting my playstyle on the fly here. Normally, I would just let these uh, J Browns start janning each other's HP like a couple of mosquitoes making out. But uh, I'm just going to run up and done up right now. You already know. So, uh, peeping. All right, I'm going to wait for this man to get to the top. All right, didn't quite get all that uh, dive kick, but that's okay, though, because I got that one off. Uh, normally, I would just start spamming dive kick here and uh, just see what lands. But nope, we're going for wombo combos today. Ooh, big time wombo combo. Wall splat. I don't know. I kind of feel like if I was just spamming dive kick and I hit him a couple times, might have had the uh, same uh, result of just getting the damage off. And also with the added bonus of uh, making the person holding the controller uh, pretty upset because I'm just spamming dive kick, making them uh, make further mistakes. But uh, to each his own, ladies and gentlemen, today we're going for straight wombos. Can't hide in the waterfall for too long. All right, big time elbow. Got to confirm off. Leading to a sumo. And uh, just pop superstar in the waterfall, thinking the uh, camouflage of the water would make it so they can't see me. But alas, it did not. Nowhere to run, nowhere to hide, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my goodness, this man just pegged me in the skull with the bat, but that is okay. And we are back to this man, ladies and gentlemen, the opportunist. Look at him going off the bounce pad just to run and hide.
Oh my goodness, another elimination out of nowhere. That person just got caught lacking super hard, ladies and gentlemen. I just rolled that man up. I just smoked him super bad. All right, astronaut pop superstar. Let's see, can he get it off? If he does, it's not going to be on me because uh, these people do not want any part of my new run up, done up play style. Normally, I would just uh, run back and uh, let him use superstar on that dude and run up and uh, pick up the scraps like some sort of a uh, vulture. But instead, I'm just running up, done up. So he manages to get a superstar off on that uh, complete jabron and uh he manages to get eliminated in the final four like a uh typical unskilled player so uh this man thinks he's slick in the corner just uh eating machos nachos but little does he know great minds think alike but my mind is greater because he's spending a little too much time hiding in the shadows so you know what i'm gonna do ladies and gentlemen i'm gonna eliminate the opportunity for a third party eliminate his opportunity take away the opportunist main opportunity ladies and gentlemen see how i just flushed him out right there because you cannot bullshit a bullshitter ladies and gentlemen i know his kind all right the sick opportunist so i used to be healed but now i'm face so i'm just using big time wombos that's why uh ddt that got off the wall splat right there instead of just uh spamming sumo while he was splatted against the wall that would have been the heal thing to do if I just like spam that sumo. Just got the two wall splats off. But uh, not today, ladies and gentlemen. Had to uh, dip from behind that spring and try to approach because I spent a little too much time hiding. Because, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're trying to keep it entertaining, guys. We're trying to show you a high level player. You see that big time approach right there? Getting that damage off. And I'm chasing him up the mountain. Yeah, let's go. But this guy seems to have a. Uh, couple brain cells floating around in there because he just seems to be running and hiding but not enough brain cells to complete the big time wombo combo see guys you got to adjust on the fly here you can't just run and hide like this guy this wannabe opportunist right here and if you do run and hide you got to do it the right way because he should be spamming right now but instead of spamming he's just getting scared leaving me to wombo combo him right there with that irish whip all right he popped superstar but i can just sense his skill level based on his inputs so uh, I'm not scared right now. Just going to go for more combos. Just an OTG elbow to the dome. The competitor. What a dummy, ladies and gentlemen. Look, look at this guy right there. Oh my goodness. Did you see that combo to win? Combo to win. Combo to win. Combo to win. Best combo in the game right there, ladies and gentlemen. The three hit strike. Oh my goodness. A little three piece. A little McNugget action. Because you know I got the sauce, ladies and gentlemen. Stop playing with me. See what happens when you just believe in yourself, ladies and gentlemen. Anything is possible. I look at my past videos. Click my past links. I was not doing Irish whips. I was not doing wall splats. I was straight being an opportunist, ladies and gentlemen. But... With the power of believing in myself and maybe 10 to 15 minutes in the playground, I have learned many wombo combos, ladies and gentlemen. So let me know in the comments what you want to see. Let me know what you like. Do you like the opportunist play style where you try to make the most out of every situation? Where you duck and hide? Where you run and gun as you've seen me do before? Until the final circle and then you just run up and dub or do you want to see me mercilessly eviscerate all my enemies one by one and then they use comeback and then me eviscerate them again and then you watch me fight the same guy for a long time now i'm just kidding ladies and gentlemen i wouldn't be fighting the same guy for a long time i just gotta get my combo game up it's a game it's all love guys no matter how you play as long as you're having fun that's what matters but you already know guys let me know what you want to see do you want to see the, the opportunist play style the, I, I know some people might think it's a little sick some people might think it's a little little unfair or do you want to see the run up done up big big wombo combo big big damage all right guys like comment and subscribe peace